These boxes allow you to specify strategies for buying, selling, and optionally exiting a trade. The buttons here are for controlling the chart. After we click the backtest button, the backtest results are shown in a list box and on the chart. Here we have a list of statistical outputs and individual trades. Each trade can be identified on the chart with an exact entry and exit price, which may optionally include slippage. If we move the simple moving average over the candles, we can see the conditions that were met. Let's change the script and run the back test again. As you can see, the crossover of the parabolic SAR has been added to the strategy. Here we can see the actual crossover points of the close from beneath the parabolic SAR. Here we have a buy, sell, and optional exit script. Statistical outputs are displayed on top, with a trade log below. The script that we type in the script text box displays in the data grid below, with almost no perceptible delay. Here, the function in the script box is calculated and populated on the worksheet instantaneously. Detailed help if we don't know the required parameters for a specific function. The required parameters are listed at the top. We can pause and edit the script while the market is trading. We can edit a script by clicking the associated Edit button. Scripts are processed simultaneously via individual threads. We can pause and edit a script while the market is trading. The other scripts will continue to run. The source of the alert sound in this example can be any standard WAV file. You can also remove the alert sound if you desire to do so. There is no limit as to the number of alerts that you may add to your application. The six alerts shown here use only a fraction of the total available CPU load. We can inspect the values by moving the mouse over the chart with the left button depressed. Help is displayed for the function in question. We are provided with the required parameters, an overview of the function, and an interpretation.
optimization can be based on any statistical output generated by the backtest report. 